We're driving through the Coromandel Peninsula right now on Highway 25 and it's been absolutely gorgeous. We're having such a good day today. It's I think around 19 or 20 degrees out. It's sunny, there's a little bit of cloud here and there. Our original plan was to go on a hike called the Pinnacles, but it was pretty far like away from where we needed to go. So we're not gonna do that today. And we're gonna go straight to the campsite after this. We made it to the campsite. We're staying at the Shelly Beach Top 10 Holiday Park. So we're keeping it within the Top 10 Holiday Park family, the same place we stayed at in Paihia or in the Bay of Islands. And we've got spot 197. It's a tenting spot and you can see behind me, beach access is right there. And then there's also a full washroom and shower facility, cooking facilities. We've got our own little picnic table. Not bad. <music> of Coromandel. It's quite windy right now, so I hope you guys can hear me. The Cathedral Cove walkway is closed right now, so we're hoping that we can get in the water on the kayak, but it's pretty rough. Like, there's a lot of very big waves. It's very windy, so it's not looking promising. morning guys sorry i didn't end off the vlog last night we ended up getting in the water going kayaking and it was just a little bit dangerous there were a lot of huge waves and we probably shouldn't have gone out but we ended up like tipping the kayak a couple of times and it was just kind of a rough night a rough day uh we ended up getting out of the water when the sun was pretty much down it took like a really long time to deflate the kayak because it's inflatable so by the end of the night, we figured it was just like unsafe to drive back to the campsite because it's like an hour and a half just over that away from where we were. So we didn't end up going to the campsite last night. We booked a hotel last minute that was really close to where we were. So we only had to drive like 25 minutes to get there. And we were so glad we did that because we were both absolutely wiped like mentally, physically. And today it's like super cloudy. It's supposed to rain all day and it's supposed to rain all day tomorrow. It was a bit of a bust this trip, which that's the reality of travel. Sometimes you have amazing experiences and you get to do really fun things. And sometimes you just get your ass kicked and that's kind of what happens. So I wanted to still post this video because that is just the reality of traveling. It's not always an amazing time and stuff can go downhill pretty quick. So I don't know what we're gonna do today. We might end up just going back to the campsite, packing up our tent and everything that we left there and then heading home. We'll see. We'll see how the day goes. We made it back to the campsite and I think we've decided to stay after all. It hasn't started raining yet and we think that, 
you know, we might get lucky and it might clear up a little bit and we're already here. It's gonna rain back in Red Beach in Auckland anyway. So we might as well stick it out and enjoy some wilderness, even though it's gonna rain. Ooh. It's very nice and warm. We're in the heated pool and there's no one here. So it's actually really not that bad. It is starting to rain, but if you're in a pool, you're wet anyway, so. a lovely swim that was such a good way to relax and we've decided to come into Coromandel town which is just about a five minute drive away from the campsite now we're gonna go and get some food somewhere here and then I think we're just gonna take it easy and relax tonight because it's quite rainy out thank you guys so much for watching this vlog we'll see you soon in the next one bye